five, four, three, two, one. So if you're interested in watching that video, you could definitely go check that out down below. It'll be below this video once I post it. So I was doing my fall haul and then I was like, you know what, let me just do a quick video on my hair because I know a lot of people are going to ask me. So I decided to just do the video right after the fall haul. So if I have the same clothes on, that's exactly why. I am about to go to class, but I was just like, you know what, let me just shoot this video for you guys because I know you guys are going to have a lot of questions about it and um, I actually am really excited to share this hair with you because I have to say that hands down this is like the second best hair I've ever had like the right way of hair Peruvian body wave hair will still always be my absolute favorite hair like I don't think I will ever get a texture that compared to that like that hair was just freaking amazing um, but this hair is definitely second best and I absolutely love this hair and I'm excited to share with you why I love it, all the specs on it. So stay tuned. Okay guys, thank you so guys for this watching. review is going to be like really super quick. Like I like to just, you know, get to the point. Sometimes when I watch hair reviews, I'm just like get to the point. So this hair is from Diamond Virgin Hair Company. Oh, you can see my ring light. <laughs> it's from Diamond Virgin Hair Company. I have, um reviewed for them before I reviewed their Brazilian mink wavy hair this is their Brazilian mink big wave hair so let me just run down the specs for you guys you know it's always on my phone because I can never remember um this is their Brazilian br mink Brazilian big wave hair the lengths are 22 22 20 18 and I did request the 18 inch closure but I did not use it and I'll explain why and those are the specs I did hair. not use the closure so I did not use the closure because even though I absolutely love my wigs I recommend wearing wigs to so many of my subscribers because it's such a protective hairstyle when I first started wearing weaves and extensions and bundles and all that stuff I was only getting so much and it was damaging my hair because my leave I would have to put heat on it every day to blend my hair and it just made my hair all chippy nippy and it just was not looking cute so I decided to just start experimenting and wearing wigs and you know now that I've gotten it down packed and my hair has grown back very healthy like my hair has grown back fully super healthy um, I decided to just you know do so ones every now and again because I love wigs but it does take time you know to make it look really natural so that people don't see your line of demarcation and all that stuff it's just like a lot of work to make your wig look you know as natural as possible without anybody noticing because that's the whole point of a wig but you know from time to time I do like to get sew-ins because I just love the natural look I do I love the natural sew-in look I get compliments every single day on this hair I get compliments all the time when I have sew-ins because it just looks so natural people are like that looks like your hair like it's just perfect so every now and again I do get sew-ins obviously when I get my sew-ins taken out I go back to wigs I just go back and forth like I'm not gonna fully commit to sew-ins because I don't want my hair to go back to how damaged it was but I do like this natural look I absolutely love it um, if you want to know where I get my hair done I will definitely leave all the information down below so now that we're done with that, that's the reason why I didn't use the closure. And when I take this hair out, I'll probably make this hair into a wig and use the closure. But anyway, so let's talk about why this is my second favorite hair, like second best. Like it's right under, like right there under Peruvian body, that Peruvian body wave. It's just right there under it. I just, I just can't get over how much I love that hair. But anyway, 
This hair is freaking amazing. And this is why I did want to take a break from doing hair reviews. And then when I came back with a hair review, you know, occasionally I wanted it to be some like good ass hair. So I am so happy that I collaborated with them again because this hair is so bomb. And for whatever reason, I cannot remember their Mink Brazilian Wavy being this nice. Like this hair is way nicer than their Mink Brazilian Wavy. And that hair was really nice, but this is just like... It's the same texture, it's just a different pattern, so I don't understand why it feels different. But this hair feels amazing, looks amazing, super natural, it holds a curl so well. Um, the only thing I would say is that I don't understand why it's classified under big wave and not just body wave, because when you get your bundles, they look like the body wave bundles. I was expecting the hair to be kind of wavy, because on the website, the girl that's modeling it, it looks like it has kind of like a slight wave. So I was expecting it to be like, you know, have like a slight wave. It was just body wave hair. I was just like, oh, it's body wave. I guess that's their, their what they call body wave, they call big wave. So just so you guys know, this hair doesn't come like in these nice, luscious, huge waves. It's just body wave hair. So, um... This is not how the hair comes, obviously. After you wash body wave hair, it kind of just has like a slight wave and then you kind of just curl it to however you like it. I just get body wave hair because I just feel like it holds a curl better than straight hair. That's the only reason why I really get body wave hair. So, um, this is the hair flat, curls with a flat iron. It holds a curl really, really well. This hair is crazy soft, like... I think this is the softest hair I've ever had and I feel like I say that a lot. I feel like every time I get new hair it's like really soft but usually when you get hair and you take it out the packaging it is really really soft. I've had this hair in for two weeks and it still feels like it did when it came out the packaging and I've washed it. So you know sometimes when you get hair when you first get it it's soft but after a couple weeks it kind of dulls down. This hair has remained the same ever since I took it out the packaging and I'm just so amazed. And my mother knows nothing about weaves, wigs or anything and even she came into my room after I got my hair done and was like damn like your hair looks nice. She was like your hair always looks nice. She was like but it's just something different about that hair like it just looks really good like and she knows nothing about weaves and wigs but even when I got my hair done she literally came in my room and was like whoa like your hair looks really nice and she always tells me my hair looks nice because it's what I do like kind of for a living but um she's never ever like been like yo your hair looks really nice she's like what type of hair is that because that's some different shit like it I, so when she came in my room and said that to me I was like oh this hair must be dope. Like, <laughs> this is some nice ass hair for my mom to be coming in my room talking about, yo, that hair is nice. So, um, I have absolutely no complaints. It does not tangle. It barely sheds. I get minimal shedding because when my stylist did do my hair, she cut every single weft. It weft. I should have told her to just fold it over, but honestly, I wasn't really paying attention. Like, I'd be so into, like, the television at the shop or, like, the conversations. I wasn't really paying attention that she was cutting my west, and that's usually something I don't do. I just fold it over because to reduce shedding, but I noticed every single line she cut my west, which is something I usually don't do. So I feel like if she wouldn't have cut my west, I really would have no shedding because even though she cut my west, it's, like, really minimal shedding. Um, what else, what else, what else? It's soft, minimal shedding, minimal tangling, holds a curl super well. It looks really, really natural. It blends with my hair really good. Even though my natural hair is like a, like a light, ashy brown, um, I did dye it to like a dark brown when my roots are coming in. But even though my roots are coming in, it kind of just looks like a highlight in my bang, which is kind of cute. But, um, that's the only thing... Our, the, our, my two hair colors are a little bit different but as far as texture this mink brazilian is really popping and I did not think that there was any difference between mink brazilian and brazilian I feel like some companies just be making up shit but um there is definitely a difference between mink brazilian and regular brazilian like mink hair is just really freaking soft and then regular brazilian is soft but it's m a little bit more coarse this hair is just it's not silky like it's just really freaking soft soft like oh so I I can't stop running my hands through it sometimes it's just so amazing and I really haven't had hair this good in a really long time and I think that's why I'm so like passionate about it because I really have not had hair this good in a really long time so to be honest I know a lot of people are gonna ask me like 
I would highly recommend this hair like highly 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 recommend this hair and it's not just gurus that I've seen that love this hair I've seen people that say that they purchased this with their own money and they love this hair so definitely check them out I will leave all the information down below and thank you guys so much for watching I will see you in the next video Mwah.